Hello everyone, in this video, I'll show you how to do a video call on Discord. Let's get started. Discord is a great place to hang out with the like-minded people and just relax. But sometimes, you want to do more than just chat using text messaging, which is where video calling comes in handy. Discord has a video call options built into the desktop app, the web browser, and the mobile app. So you don't need to switch between different software when you want to chat on video with your friends or colleagues. So first, let's talk about the best settings for Discord video call. Before you start calling everyone, you'll want to check your settings to make sure you have the best experience. It's important to make sure you've got your best equipment set up to work for the highest quality audio and video possible. So start by heading to the user settings page. You'll find this at the bottom left off the screen. Look for the cog icon next to your name. You won't see this on your mobile. This is only on the desktop app and the web browser version of Discord. Once you've opened settings, you'll want to click voice and video tab. Here you can check your microphone settings and adjust the volume and choose your camera. If you're using an external camera instead of the built-in option, check that the right one is selected in the drop-down. You can also use this opportunity to run a test video so that you know you're well lit, properly framed, and otherwise good to go. You can adjust the lighting in your room or move the camera if you don't feel it's quite right. One quick note. For the web browser version of Discord, you'll be asked to grant permission to your microphone and camera. Make sure you allow the site to use your equipment, otherwise it won't work on the video call. Once you're happy, just click the close button at the top right of the settings option. Moving on, let's talk about how to make a private video call on Discord. Once you've got your settings ready, you're set to make your private Discord video call. If you're doing it on the web browser or desktop app, you'll need to first navigate to the inbox you share with the person you want to call. Do this by clicking on the home button at the top left. You'll then get a list of all your contacts. If you're only calling one person, then it's easy. Just click on their name. If you want to call a private group, you need to click the plus button and then create a group DM. Add the names of the users you want to call. Once you're in the direct message window of the person or the group you want to call, you need to look at the buttons at the top right of the screen. The second icon that looks like a video camera is the one you're looking for. Click that and you'll start a video call. You'll see yourself on screen at this point. But you'll need to wait until the other person or the group members have joined the call for the chat to properly begin. The process of making video call on Discord mobile is essentially identical. You just need to open the direct message group and click on the video call icon, which is still at the top right of your screen. You'll need to give permissions for the Discord mobile app to use your microphone and camera if you haven't already. Once you've finished your video call on either desktop or mobile, just hit the red button to end it and switch your camera off again. Now let's talk about how to make a server video call on Discord. If you want to make a group video call on a public server, you again need to first navigate to the server. Once you're there, you'll need to join the voice channel that you should see on the left side of the screen. Once you're in the voice channel, click launch, community hangout, or stream room, and then switch on your camera by clicking the video button. You'll find this at the bottom left of the screen. Again, if you're on the web browser, you'll be asked by your browser for permission to use your camera at this stage. And that's it. The video call is now live, and anyone who joins the voice channel will be able to see you, chat to you, and switch on their camera to join the video conference as well. On mobile, it's slightly different. You'll still want to head to the server you want to join and then click on the voice channel to join it. But as soon as you click the voice channel, you'll get a pop-up with an icon at the bottom right where you can instantly switch on your camera. 
If you prefer, you can still just join as a voice, and then at any stage, click on your name, where you'll be able to then switch on your camera to turn a voice chat into a video call. Whenever you want to end the video call, just click on your name again to switch off your camera or disconnect completely from the voice channel. And there you have it, how easy it is to do a video call on Discord. I hope you find this video helpful. And before this video ends, Did you know that you can make cold emails easy? Run perfectly designed killer cold email campaigns that turn leads into buyers fast. Introducing Pursue App by Technic Force, cold email automation done right. Pursue App makes it easy to run successful cold email campaigns for any business. Here's what you can get in Pursue App. Personalized cold email marketing engine, commercial license, lead verification system, custom crafted customer journeys, multi-event triggers for email, deep analytics and reporting, warm leads identification, ARB testing, ready-made email themes for many niches, events and conversion tracking, integration with thousands of apps with Zapier, inbuilt API for custom integrations, multi-user support, support for Gmail, G Suite, Outlook, and SMTP, agency license, one-year free update, 24-6 support, cold email training, and ready-made cold email campaigns. So try Pursue App now. Just go to getpursueapp.in. And that is it for today's video. Thank you for watching and see you on the next one.